So welcome you guys to the In The Pink team call. We're super excited to have everyone here tonight joining us. We do have our team calls every single Tuesday night at nine o'clock, so you can always count on it. It's our water cooler. This is where we where work our businesses during the week, and then we come together at least once a week where we get to spend time together, learn, and grow together. So I always, I love live calls, so I always encourage you guys to get on live. It is recorded, so you can always listen to it afterwards um, also. Live's nice, though, because you get to ask questions and be a little bit interactive with our speakers. Um, so tonight, we have a very, very special guest who I had the wonderful pleasure to meet first in Las Vegas. We just happened to randomly, honestly, you guys be walking down the hallway to one of our events and I saw Emily and hi, you know, we're happy plexus people. So what do you do when you're a happy plexus person is you introduce yourself to the person standing next to you. So that's actually how Emily and I met. We started, we struck up a wonderful conversation. We learned that we had a lot in common. And since then, I have grown to absolutely adore Emily. We've spent time together in Kona. Um, we had a wonderful conversation on the beach, and I really got to learn a lot from her. Emily happens to be, um, and she's going to share her story, and I'm not exactly sure how long it took her to get to Emerald, but it's not long. She's going to tell you guys. But she's on one of the fastest growing teams in the entire company. Um, if you guys have heard of the, the Pauls, Amy and Eric Paul, who both are their diamond du uh, double, or both diamond married couple, and then Brooke Hemingway, who always ranks you know, on the leaders board, and then also Emily has been on the leaders board for top building bonuses several, several times in the last few months. So they have a team that has really figured out duplication. They have figured out how to get their ambassadors running, hitting the ground running right away. And so she has a lot of things that we, that she's going to share tonight that we can learn from. So I want you to have your notebooks out. I want you to have your pens out. I want you to have open minds and open hearts to really receive what Emily's going to share because she's going to share something that we can duplicate also for our team. And so that would be my hope as we're running, getting ready for the new year. Okay. So Emily, take it away, girl. Oh, Dawn, I love you and I feel so blessed to be with you guys tonight so thank you for having me and i just i hope you all know what an amazing leader you have in dawn because i just she's taught me so much about heart people and um yeah i just i love you so um a little bit about me i actually started uh i joined plexus last october 19th and it took three weeks for my products to get to me because the big back office switchover had just happened. And I thought for sure that Plexus had stolen my money and it was a scam. And, and I called um, to cancel three times because, and there was all, there was like an hour wait time and I couldn't get through. And I just, I told my husband, I was like, I think I did something really bad. I've been tricked into something. This like can't be a legitimate company. And, um, thank goodness I never got through those three times. I really think it was a blessing from God because he knew that I had more to do with Plexus than just order some products and return them. So uh, on my products came and I started taking them about Halloween last year and right away I noticed that I didn't want any of my kids Halloween candy which was pretty crazy for me and then I started noticing that I was waking up really rested and not feeling exhausted all of the time and I am the type of person who likes to share with everybody so I thought I'll make a video for my friends on Facebook and um, I didn't tell my sponsor Brooke Hemingway that I was gonna share when I ordered I told her I will never share don't ask me to share I will never do a business and don't ever talk to me about it because I'm not interested and so to her surprise I posted a six minute video on November 12th last year you can find it on Facebook it's titled fully out of the plexus closet and I literally hadn't showered in three days I was in this grubby old t-shirt and I held my baby in front of me because he had just barfed all down my shirt and I didn't want anyone to see that I had baby barf on me and I felt so prompted to make that video right then and there and I had walked around my house and kind of avoided the prompting several times and all of a sudden I just felt like you sit down and make this video right now 
and I thought, okay, fine, I'll make this video, and no one's gonna watch it, and it will just be all for nothing. And I posted that video, and um, put it on Facebook, and went to get my daughter from kindergarten. And 45 minutes later, I came home, and my phone was buzzing the whole time, and I was like, what is going on? And I opened up my Facebook inbox, and there were 45 messages. And on the video, there were 22 comments. And I called Brooke and I said, I've done something. I don't know what, but I need help. I don't know what to do with this. And, um, and so we, it just started from there. And that night I got on a Zoom call with Amy Paul for the first time and met her. Brooke had been trying to get me to meet her and I was like, I don't wanna meet your cute friend because I'm not building this business. And so finally I was like, okay, fine. Um, now that I know this works, I've got to find a way to pay for it. So maybe I'll get on and meet your friend Amy. And I'm so glad I did because she was so cute and wonderful and loving. And, um, and then six months later, I ranked Emerald and became the first Jewel of Utah. And that was so amazing. I, um, I ran from start to finish and I am still running. Um, I'm, I love that I have a team that's running with me. and. A lot of a lot of what took me to Emerald was what I'm gonna share with you tonight and that is not rocket science and I think that's the thing that a lot of people miss is they make it complicated and it's really very simple um, when I first started running um, I was doing a lot of personal sponsoring and I still do that it's one of my passions to personally sponsor people I always make it a goal to sponsor um, anywhere from 6 to 12 people every month um, if I'm not private messaging people about Plexus I feel like it's like I haven't read my scriptures for the day it's like that type of a pull within me and um, and so we I found this one girl back in February and I had just watched a call by Sarah Taylor Brooke and I had just watched it and she had talked about how she got momentum on her team building and right before I enrolled my friend Jenny we had said well maybe we'll start asking people to post on Facebook from day one like that sounds like the craziest idea ever because how could you ask someone to post if they don't have a testimonial of the products yet? That was how we had from November to February, that's how we were running our business was, okay, try the products and I can't wait to hear how you like them. And we would wait for people to tell us they were loving the products before we asked them to post. And in February, that's when we saw um, this, this video that Sarah Taylor had made about uh, getting people silver in seven days and if you haven't seen that video go watch it on YouTube because it's amazing and that is what we started to do we thought okay well we'll just try it with the next person that enrolls and the next morning my friend uh, I didn't even know her actually it's a funny story my friend now Jenny she messaged me and said can your son your son Brennan's in class with my son Jaron can we have a play date and I had just, I was doing Amy Paul's Journey 101 training program at the time. And that morning she had said, practice a one-liner on somebody um, next time you meet them. And she had said, oh yeah, we can play on Tuesday and Thursday because I work, but my husband works from home. So really any day is good. And I thought, this is my moment. I'm going to try on this stranger and I'm sure she's going to ignore me. And I said, oh, okay, great. I work from home too. It's called Plexus. Have you heard of it before? And she said, no, I've never heard of it before. Tell me about it. And I said, oh, you know, it got rid of all my tiredness and my, you know, desire for sugar and, um, and, and I, all my mood issues are gone and, and yeah, but we can play on Tuesday. And I kind of gave her an out, you know, and she messaged back and said, I need it. Can I order right now? And she literally text messaged me, a complete stranger text messaged me all of her information to enroll on the spot as an ambassador. And I still laugh at that story. And she fast started gold. And the reason why she fast started gold, you guys, is because we watched that Sarah Taylor video the night before and decided to go for it. So she enrolled. I had never talked to this woman before. And she's a unique person. Like most people are not like Jenny, obviously. But um, I messaged her and said, oh, and by the way, would you want to post like a two liner on Facebook? that says, hey, I'm trying Plexus. It helped my friend Emily, uh, you know, get rid of her mood issues, have better energy, and 
um, and quit craving sugar. Anybody want to do it with me? And I thought for sure she'd tell me no, and she told me yes, and posted it on Facebook and enrolled three people in an hour. And Brooke and Amy and I are on the phone with each other screaming like, you don't even know this girl? You've never met her? And I was like, no, I don't know her, but I think she's got something special. And we just ran with her. And because, uh, because we had this giant influx, um, we had to come up with a system that was duplicatable very quickly because she knew nothing about the products. She knew nothing about the business. And it just opened our eyes to what could this do for our whole business if we did this with everybody? And so we started doing that. And that, and, and that month, Brooke won Silver Stars. So we got to go to Scottsdale and, and do the Silver Stars trip with each other in April. It was amazing. Um, and and we, we always say, thank you, Jenny, because <laughs> Jenny forced us into uh, creating a duplicatable system. So how did we do this? Okay. Every single time that somebody orders or enrolls, we tell them, uh, we walk them through ordering over the phone, first of all. And if, you, if they absolutely cannot be walked over the phone, like they, they don't want to talk on the phone, they just want to order on their own, that's fine. Uh, I, I prefer talking face-to-face -face with people, you know, not face-to-face, -face, but I prefer talking with people over the phone to ask them to share on Facebook. Uh, because I like them to see my personality when I do it and hear my heart. And so if I can't do that, I'll try and send it in a voice message or a voice text. If they have an iPhone, you can do that also. Um, and what I say is, so I enroll them and I say, you know, I'm so excited for you to get your products. And... Um, you know, I really feel like I've been suffering for eight years with my mood issues and the things that I've gone through. And, um, and I wish that somebody would have told me about Plexus sooner. So every single time that, that I have someone join Plexus, I always invite them to post a two liner on their Facebook page that says something like, Hey guys, I'm trying this new supplement called Plexus that helped my friend Emily have better sleep, get rid of her mood issues and stop craving sugar. Does anyone want to do it with me? And then you can post that with a picture of yourself and tag me in it. So I can leave a supportive comment on your Facebook page. And then anybody that asks questions like, what is it? Tell me more. How much is it? You can start a three-way message with that person, you and me. And in that message, you'll say, oh, hey, I just ordered, so I don't know that much. But, you know, my friend Emily has been using the products for a while, and she can answer any of your questions. Um, and then at that, and I, then I say, would you like me to send that for you? And see how awkward and silent it is after I say that and I don't say anything after? That's what you want. That's the golden ticket. Okay. You want to leave the direct question and I didn't even leave them any room to breathe. Right. I didn't even breathe. I just said my little spiel. I say at the same time, every time. Hey, the Emily, can you say it again? Cause I miss, I, yeah. I want to write it down. Say it again. Yeah, yeah. And I also actually have, um, I actually have it written in a note and I can put it in the notes here on the call for you also, because, um, that's what makes it duplicatable, right? Like I can do it for anybody, but what can my team do? And my team is duplicating it. And that's why my name's on the leaders board. That's why it's working because it's duplicatable. So this is what I say. They enroll and just before you're saying goodbye and you know, I could just say goodbye and I could get off this call right now and it'd be so easy, right? Cause you've done your job. You've made your welcome pack bonus. You just, it'd be so easy to hang up. Don't do that. Do not hang up. Even with your chicken list people always ask every single time. And that's what is, that's the hard thing is it's easy to get out of it. And I want you to, I want to encourage you tonight to not get out of it because this is the most important part. Do retention before they're ever enrolled and do retention from the time they place their order. And if you will do that, if you will get people silver in seven days and, and not everybody is going to do it and not everybody is going to, is going to do that. But if you will practice on every single person, somebody is going to surprise you like you have never been surprised before and run and you're going to be swamped with three ways for like a day and sometimes it works out and sometimes it doesn't and i know some people think that it's um 
you know, a waste of time, but I personally really love it. And, um, and now it's fun to have a whole team of people that do it because I'm not in all those three ways anymore because I've trained these people. And that's the magic of the three way there is you're in the three way message with them and you have this brand new ambassador who's getting new ambassador training at the same time that they're enrolling their first ambassador. And I just love it. They're getting product training in there because you're sharing how the products work. They're watching how you relate to people. They're seeing how you overcome the obstacle of price. They're seeing how you respond to things. And what we've done on our team is we've copied and pasted about 150 different notes for how to respond to the most common questions because everybody always asks the same thing. Everybody, they all want to know. And, and, um, and especially like I'm, I'm Mormon. And so there are like two or three questions that we always get every single time, right? Is, is there caffeine in the slim? Is there coffee in the slim? Well, I just have this little pre-written thing and I had like prayed and prayed about how to respond to this. So I wrote down that and I just copy and paste that whole little note to my team. So they are duplicating exactly what has worked for me every single time, but without all the emotion and exhaustion of trying to think about it 50 million times. Right? So, um, okay. And, um, Okay, let me read one of the questions. Do you say this to folks who are adamant they are wholesale only ambassadors too? Um, so I even ask preferred customers to post because they can refer to you and you can sponsor these people or you can enroll them as a preferred customer because um, I don't ask people to post on Facebook to start a business and get their products paid for. If you, I'll say it again, like Don asked, and you can hear how I relate because what I found is most people have a little bit of yellow in them. Everybody, the reds, the greens, the blues, the, everybody has a little bit of yellow in them. And so what I do is I relate to the yellow part of people's personalities and I say, so they just ordered and I say, okay, so I just want to say one last thing before we hang up. I'm so excited for you. Um, I, I, I really feel like I've been suffering for eight years with the issues that I've been dealing with. And I wish that I would have found Plexus sooner. And I know that there are people in your life right now who are dealing with things that they have just accepted to be normal. And um, I don't accept being tired and having mood issues and craving sugar and having crappy sleep as normal anymore. And I know that as I have shared my story, I have helped so many people. So anytime that someone joins my team, I always invite them to post a two-liner on Facebook that says, hey guys, I'm trying this new supplement called Plexus that helped my friend Emily have better sleep, more energy, and get rid of her sugar cravings. Does anyone want to do this with me? And then when you post that, if you have anyone go in and say, what is this? Tell me more. Um, what, what does it cost? Then you can just start a three-way message with that person, you and me. And in that message, you'll say, hey, you know, I just ordered, so I don't know anything, but this is my friend Emily that I was telling you about, and she can answer your questions and I can learn with you. So go ahead. I know you were asking about the cost of Plexus and then that's my time to come in. And of course I have my introduction in a note copied and pasted because work smarter, not harder. And I just go into the notes on my phone and I copy and paste it and I paste it in the thing and I have a little blank spot so I can personalize it with their name. And it says, I so-and-so I'm Emily gives a short part of my story. And then it says, if they've asked a question like, what's the price of Plexus? I say, you know, the cost of Plexus really depends on what you're looking to address. Can you tell me a little bit about what interests you about Plexus? Because something that they read in that two liner made them interested. And I can't tell them what products to take until they have told me what their issue is. So then they tell me what their issue is. I address that. Then I give them the price and then we go from there. But the key is to ask them on the phone and overcome their obstacles before you even say, would you like me to do that? Would you like me to send that two liner for you? And then you just leave it really quiet and let it get just a teeny bit awkward because that's going to evoke a response. And, um, 
And no, I would not post bigger tickets because that would not be compliant. And I'm sure you've noticed how very carefully I've described everything on my story tonight. And that's because I wholeheartedly believe that if we will be compliant, we will reach a larger amount of people. And when we start naming diseases and symptoms, we already push out all those people that think they're healthy and don't deal with those issues. When really, a lot of people deal with a lot of those diseases and names, but they don't recognize that they do. So if you go on and you say, oh my gosh, you know, I'm always tired, I need more energy, and I crave lots of sugar, then all of those people are going to, people who are reading that are going to be like, I have that. I have that, I have that, but when we name it with a specific disease or condition, we automatically isolate those people from thinking that they don't need plexus. So yeah, so I keep it really, really open, yeah. Um, and so that's how I do it, and, and I train my team to do it. And it takes a lot of time, and some people just can't get it until they're like senior gold. And then they call me and they say, I have a confession to make. And I say, yeah. And they go, I haven't been asking my people to post on Facebook. I'm like, I know. I know because you're your only runner, right? They're like, yeah, I'm my only runner. I'm like, okay, well, who's loving their products right now? Who's currently loving that? Because usually you can get to senior gold without a ton of white lines, right? Because they're just kind of maybe like, ordering they're liking their products but once you get to senior gold I feel like that's when attrition kind of starts to catch up and so um sorry my son just came in go go out out right now go I have the guitar people thank you <laughs> sorry <laughs> so that's okay um, it's like what six o'clock there yeah it's 7 30 so okay. we're like yeah in the midst of bedtime so <laughs> Anyway, so um, so that is he wants to say hi. I'm sorry, we just got to give it. No, it's right. awesome. Hi, this is Brennan. He's my oldest. Hi, Brennan. Hello. Okay, go. your mommy's awesome. We yeah. love her. Hi, go. Okay. Oh, <laughs> man. I'm so sorry. Okay. Okay. So white lines are people who have turned their auto ship off, Leslie. Um, that's for people who have decided they don't want to order or some people still order and they don't have an auto ship turned on. But um, yeah, an auto ship turned on is a green or blue line and a white line is when someone has deleted their auto ship or has less than 100 PV in an unconditional auto ship. You're welcome. Okay, so um, Dawn, what, what do I need to go in more depth with, with this system? I think that's pretty simple. It's you, you sign them up, you enroll, that's good. So every single person you make a point to get on the phone with them and enroll them, you walk them yes. through it. And then before yes. that I'm personally, that I'm, yeah, that I'm personally sponsoring. Mm -hmm. and I tell my team, everyone, you personally sponsor, get on the phone and enroll them. And it's not perfect every time. Like I just had someone, uh, you know, a half an hour ago, I was supposed to enroll her. We were going to do it right before the call and it just wasn't working out. Her phone kept dropping the call and I was like, girl, here are the directions. I'm going to call you later. And so tonight I'm going to call her and I'm going to ask her to post on Facebook tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to let that get away because she's the medical assistant to my OBGYN who I've been to for the last 10 years. And I wanted her to join so badly and I'm not going to miss an opportunity to get that girl sharing on Facebook when she's excited to start Plexus. Mm -hmm. because if you wait until they're going through die off, whew, you all know how that goes. So, um, uh, Kelly Norman spoke on a call once and she told me or told us in the group, the first 48 hours is the most crucial, and I've never forgotten that. And it's so true. If you can get people to post on Facebook the day they order and get, uh, and get them to silver that first week, I promise your retention will skyrocket because when people's products are paid for or partially paid for, it's a great way to pull them through die-off. 
Because normally they've got that burst of energy in the first two weeks, and then maybe the second month they start having some die-off symptoms. They're having some fatigue. They're not feeling too hot. Maybe they're bloating. That's what happened to me. And if they have people ordering under them, you can say, oh, I saw you turned your auto ship off. Oh, I really want to encourage you to order this month because number one, you're going to feel so much better after 90 days because the body regenerates new healthy cells every 90 days. We just want to get everybody to 90 days. Um, and, and, oh, I really don't want you to miss out on your commission check because you have those three people under you. And so you're gonna actually make some money when their auto ships go through as long as you place an order of 100 points or more. Do you need me to help you set that back up again? And every time you guys, I have, every time they go, really? I didn't know that. Yeah, I'll turn it back on. I'll stick with it one more month. And, and, and I'm not saying I have perfect retention either because I've still lost people and I've still made mistakes, but this system, oh, I can't say enough about it. This, and now that my team is doing it, it will catapult you into explosive growth and momentum that is unstoppable and it takes practice and it takes, it's just like anything in life. The more you do it, the better you get. And I have been preaching this to my team for since like February. And I feel like right now they're finally all getting it. And it's like, go, 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 go. So how do you get them to enroll lots of people so that they can get these lots of people to post on Facebook to then create momentum? Well, you tell them to reach out to every single person they could ever possibly know that might want Plexus by direct message. And I'm sure Dawn has told you this. I'm sure that you've heard this before, but yet people try to complicate it. They make a Facebook group. They put all their friends in it. They post in it. And they wonder why nobody joins their team. Um, I had a friend join a different company this last week. And um, I was really sad that she spent $6,000 for her startup cost because I've been telling her to do Plexus for $34.95, but it's just too good to be true, I guess, uh, except it's not. So, um, and she put me in a Facebook group and I took myself right out because it's a passive way, right? So um, when I say it's not rocket science what we do, it's so simple. And this is all I do all day long. I reach out to anybody that crosses my mind that I think could use Plexus. Everywhere I go, I talk about Plexus. I bring it up in conversations. So for example, I enrolled my post office person because we were, I was mailing samples and she wasn't talking to me and I was, she was, but she was working and I said, Oh yeah, nice day. She's like, Oh yeah, nice day. And I said, so I'm mailing samples. And she goes, oh, really? And I go, yeah, for my work. It's called Plexus. Have you heard of it before? And she said, no, I haven't. I said, yeah, I got rid of my sugar cravings, got rid of all my low energy. She goes, oh, that sounds like something I need. And then I go, yeah, and I lost 32 pounds, like totally crazy. And I like sleep great. And she goes, what? I think I might need that. And I said, you do need that. Here, I have a sample right here. And here's my business card. Will you write your phone number on the back of it with your name? And I'll call you later. I don't give my business cards out because where do they go? In the garbage. But not if you give it to them to show them you're a professional and write their name on the back. So then I put it in my pocket and I said, are you on Facebook? And she said yes. And I had her add me right there in the post office. She's still ringing me up because I had like 55 samples there. <laughs> and, um, and so friended her on Facebook. And then I went home that day and messaged her a few hours later and said, hey, what did you think of the taste? And she said, I liked it. And I said, oh my gosh, well, the main ingredient is chromium and chromium controls insulin and insulin is the body's master hormone. And when you balance that hormone, blah, 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 blah. And then she ended up ordering because I struck up a conversation and, um, and made elevator talk, right? Small talk. Mm -hmm. um, so, so get out from behind your computer. If your Facebook friend list is depleted, it's time to make new friends.
Yes. What does your first message look like when you cold call someone? What do you say? When I like, if I were like to cold contact someone in my Facebook message, yeah, someone that's never asked you about Plexus before. I, what I said, and I love this one because now she just, um, she just ranked gold. Um, it was to a nurse that I went to high school with and I said, Hey Tiffany. So I saw that you work night shift and my gosh, I bet you are so tired working the night shift. I have this, um, I have this really great, you know, thing. They just came out with this new product called the edge and it's clean, sustainable energy. And I'm sure you've seen the rest of my Facebook stuff on Plexus. Have you ever thought of trying it before for yourself? And this is a really easy one because she messaged back and said, yeah, I've been meaning to call you. I'm, I, yeah, I'll order it. And she ordered it, got a double welcome pack, and then, um, and then had her sister come with her and join. Um, another one that I've done before, I was sitting at my parents' lake house this summer in July, and we were up late one night, and I thought, you know, I'm just going to do like a 50-person blitz because I like to sit down and do a big chunk all at once instead of like two or three every day. It's just easier for me to just blast them all out in a big chunk once a week. So my magic number is 50. I try to do 50 a week. And I sat down and I said, hey, I'm just sitting here at my parents' lake house shaking my head because I can't believe how good I feel. And it was vitamins that did it. Have you ever thought about trying Plexus for yourself? And I sent that out. And I got, usually when I do that, and this was, this was the same thing, I usually get one person to enroll, three to four people that ask for more information, four to five that tell me no straight out because they're healthy and they get everything they need from their food and exercise, so they don't need my supplement. Poor me. I know. And then the rest ignore me. So I usually have about 40 people ignore me. And then what happens is two or three months later, one or two of those will message me and say, so I know you messaged me two or three months ago and I've been watching your posts since then and I'm ready to, I'm ready to hear more about Plexus now. And sometimes I tell them the price and they're not ready all of a sudden again, but that's fine because I'm going to follow up with them when I see they're posting about being tired next month and check in with them. And, um, okay, I send out a stick of Slim. That's the only sample I give. I have, I've done everything. I've tried doing the three-day starter packs. I've tried giving out little cute things with X Factor in it. And what I found, and I've done like an edge here or there for a friend. Um, what I have found is that people think pills out of a bottle are creepy. And they can't feel anything anyway in one day, with the exception of the edge. And that's one that I still will on occasion give, um, usually to somebody who has already ordered. And I say, hey, here's seven, here's seven edge. Just, you know, see if you like it, you know. Um, and some people love it and some people hate it. So, yeah, there's that. But I usually just give out a, a stick of a pink drink and I always say, it's just for taste. You need to commit to 90 days if you really want to see what it can do for you. However, most people find that they have more energy and better sleep in the first two to four weeks. And every time I send out a sample or hand out a sample to somebody in person, I always get their name and phone number on the back of my business card to show that I'm a professional. For a while, I just always wanted everyone to be my friend on Facebook. And then I had an ambassador on my team who's really experienced in network marketing. His name is Jared Foster. And he told me, yeah, but that doesn't show that you're a professional. A business card shows you're a professional and you can also be their Facebook friend, but show them you are for real. And that totally changed the way that I looked at business cards. And I use them as a tool now instead of throwing money in the garbage can. Very good. That's a good, really good tip. Really good. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think I've ever given out a business card and, and had someone order it. Yeah. I just, it, unless you're, you're getting the information to follow up, it's, yeah, it's just a waste of contact. Seriously, Dawn, I want you to tell me the first person that you enroll using this method because now it works so well. I can't mm -hmm. even believe it because you are in control of what happens to that business card now. Mm-hmm have that follow-up. 
I'm the most excited about making people post. I think that I had, yeah. I had heard that, so I really loved just hearing it from yeah. you firsthand. Yes. Um, so coming up with that and just saying, just making it the expectation. Yes, you know? and make it, the make it about helping people in their life. Because most people that do this as a business, it's an accidental business. I have two people on this team, on my team of 11, uh, like of 1160 people on my team, two of them started for the business. And those two people are not gold ambassadors yet. Mm. So just because you start for the business doesn't mean you're going to be good at the business. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So let me, before you go, I know you got to can put your babies in bed. I don't want to hold you up. So what about dream teamers? They're a little bit different. Do you think that they're different? Do you do anything different for them? I do. In the beginning, I almost left them alone. Well, in the beginning, I left them alone and said nothing to them because I was so afraid. I thought, well, they'll just love the products and I'll just wait for them to be ready. And I lost every single one of them. I could cry. I lost every single one of them. And so, um, now, hold on, I've got one more saying goodnight. <laughs> Hi. This is Maxine. Hi. Hi, cutie. Go to bed. Mom, I'm not going to bed. Okay. I got a break because okay. I already took a shower okay. like a long time okay. ago. Okay, okay, go. Close the door. Thank you. Um, so, when I made my list of 100 back in November, when Amy Paul asked me to do it. Hey, um, when I did that, my number one person, I wrote her name down and I never cold contacted her. Never. And that's because I knew this one friend and I want to preface this with, I am scared. I'm not scared to cold contact anyone. I knew this one person was the exception of my whole list of 100 because she, and I can say this about her cause she knows it. But um, she is the type of person who, if I would have done that, it would have been game over for her. She would have never come. So I patiently waited, knowing that she was rolling her eyes at me, thinking that I was crazy doing plexus. And finally, nine months in, I get this text message from her saying she's ready to go. And I called, um, I called and had a conversation with Stephanie Abrams, who's my diamond upline also. It goes... We're all under Eric, and then it goes, um, so it goes me, Brooke, Eric Paul, Amy Paul, Stephanie Abrams, and then Elizabeth Spohn, or Carl, and then Elizabeth. Anyway, so um, I called Stephanie because she is just so good at knowing people's color personalities, and she's taught me so much about that. Um, and so do Brooke and Amy there. I mean, everybody I'm, I'm that's on my team is an absolute genius, but this one day I just felt like I'm going to call Stephanie and see what she has to say. And I told her about my friend and I said, Stephanie, I want this girl for the business. Like she's the next Celeste Gwen. I like, can't say enough about this girl, but I don't know how to talk to her about the business because I know she's super turned off about it. And, um, and, but I knew that I was not going to let another one of my top five go because I just lost them all. And so with her, I, 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 and this is what I would tell you to do. Find out what motivates your person. What is motivating about them? What makes them tick? Me, I'm super blue. So tell me I'm going to win a Lexus and a trip to Hawaii and, um, and a shopping spree and girl, I'm going to work until I die because I just want the fun and the party. But that's, that was never going to be appealing to Brie. What's appealing to Brie is different because she has a different personality. She's more like serve others and, and give of your money to philanthropies and, um, you know, use your skills. And so I talked to her and said, but Brie, how much could $100,000 a year do for Healing Hands for Haiti? Like, what could you do with that money? If you could donate $100,000 to Healing Hands for Haiti, which is her cause, you can Google it and make donations. It is amazing. Um, and I won't go into detail about it, but just Google it. And she talks about, she was like, well, that could run the clinic for three years. That could run the school for three years. 
And, and, and I started planting these little seeds with her and, um, and I gave her the product. She's my, she's lives close to me. So I gave her the products right away and I said, okay, so we're going to post a picture of your pink drink and then you're going to put it in your Facebook feed. And she said, well, I don't want to. And I said, yeah, you're right. It would totally suck to go to Hawaii for free with me. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> And she said, she said, she's like, don't do that. I'm like, well, I'm just saying you probably shouldn't post because you should let everybody else in Utah enroll your network under them. You don't want them, right? Like you don't, it would, it, you should, you don't want to make $10,000 a month. You don't want that. <laughs> and, um, and, and I can tease her because that's our relationship. And, but I did that before she went through any detox symptoms. So she posted, she went silver in 24 hours, like I knew she would. And then she went through detox for a month and was very quiet and didn't want to reach out to anybody. And now it's her third month and she's feeling awesome again. And we're doing a sip and see at her house on Thursday. So find out what motivates people. If they're really yellow and they care of like their main thing is caring about others and helping others, then play into that. If they hate their job, play into that. If they, um, whatever it is, your dream team though, you should be leading with the business in mind. And don't ever forget that because I didn't do that until 10 month, 10, nine or 10 months into Plexus and it has changed everything. Mm -hmm. I love the products. Mm -hmm. This company is nothing without the products, right? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for the products, but I want to do this business with my friends and I have that. And now I want them all with me. So if you get one of your dream team on the products, the very first thing you do is say, Girl, we got to get you posting on Facebook right now because you're going to be with me next year in Maui and we're going to start today. You guys, I didn't post my first post until November 12th. It's November 1st. A year ago, I was on day three of the products. And I was in Kona this last year. I and close to, and close to Sapphire, right? Yes. Yep. I'm pretty close. I'm I'm really really close. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, and hey, you can do this. You can do this, guys. Yes, yes, yes. You have I the time, it. and I didn't figure out momentum until February. Right. So if you will do it now, if you're established, if you've been with Plexus for a year or two. Go back through your back office and write down everybody's names of your wholesalers who love the products. If they don't want to post, say, oh, would you post your story on Plexus on your Facebook page? If they say no, say, okay, would you mind if I shared it on my Facebook page? Mm -hmm. And they go, yeah, okay. And then you say, would you like me to tag you in it? And then they usually say, yeah, okay, that'd be fine. They just post it on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Okay. Most people don't have that setting set anyway to where they can't, where you can't tag them. So usually it just comes up in their Facebook feed. And, and the other thing too, is you usually have a lot of mutual friends. And so you posting their story is really posting to your net, their network as well. So that's great too. Aggressively go after your, your dream team. It's no fun if your dream team is not with you. Because what happens is you enroll awesome new friends and they become your best friends and they bring on their dream team and you go to these events and you're like, but my best friend in non-plexus world is not here with me, but hers is, oh, I wish mine was here with me. <laughs> and that's when, you, that's when you call her from the pool and you say, Brie, will you, we're doing a sip and see on Thursday. Start inviting right now because you're coming with me next year. I literally did that from the pool, you guys. I called this girl and I was like, enough already. You're doing this with me and I want you here. So get yeah. on it. <laughs> yes. I did the same thing. I took an afternoon in, in Kona and messaged like 10 people. I'm yes. like, oh my gosh, you've got to get here. You've got to be enough here with already. me. 
Yes. Yeah. And, yeah. and I, that's what I just say. Like, just be bold. Be bold. Be bold. Yeah, be bold. Be, be a little bit bossy, but not, but, but in a classy way. Okay. okay, team. Are you guys ready? We, all right, we're going to make, we're, you know what, Emily, would you mind that, um, that I've wrote it down a few times, but I think I missed something like that one post that you say, that you say, my friend, will you just type it out and paste it and either you can send it to me and I'll make sure everybody sees it. Yep. I'll send everybody it just has that kind of like first post. So it's super simple. Awesome. Yep. All and right. yes, I do. I do ask my preferred customers to post too. I actually just had a friend that's been on the products for three months and I messaged her today and I said, Oh, can you do me a favor? Cause I would love to share your story. And then when, when people love her stuff, I'm going to either say, Hey, do you want to upgrade to ambassador mm -hmm. or do you want to just give me your referrals? Cause I would love to enroll your people if you don't want to do it. Yeah. Right. Yes. Yeah. You guys, I, I know this was, you guys are blessed. I know I'm, we're getting all kinds of good feedback. Thank you. Awesome info. Thank you. Good stuff. Emily, I knew it was going to be amazing. So I'm glad we had a good, I think we topped out at like 36 people. So that was good. Thanks Our for having me. I got really blessed tonight. Well, thank you so much for taking your time. Maybe your thank babies you. are still awake. You can still go yeah. give them a big kiss. I'm going to go love on them. Go love on the babies. That's what's so great about what we do, right? We make it work. Thank, thank you, you, Emily. You have awesome. Bye. Big things in your future, girl. <sighs> All right, team. So there you go. There you have it. That's what the most explosive, that is by far the most explosive team in um, Plexus right now. When you look at the leaders board, you will see Amy Paul, Eric Paul, Brooke Hemingway, and Emily Gibson. So that whole downline is um, in the top enrollers and also the building bonuses that we get every month. So, you know, what obviously what they're doing is working. Um, and so, like she said, it's not rocket science. We just have to be the ones that implement and be bold and um, I will get the good information from her and let's do it. So super excited you guys. Um, all right, let me, I want to do some announcements. It is November the 1st and we had an incredible, incredible, incredible month. Let me get back to my notes here. Um, okay. We're getting late. So I think I can do this in 10 minutes or less. So we'll have a, a solid hour call. So I want you guys to get out your, um, if you've got a notebook, kind of jot down these dates. I've already got the calendar really full in November because we had an awesome October. We're going to get geared up <laughs> the next 90, 60 days. Well, what we do in the next 60 days in November and December is going to plant the seeds and set us up for an incredible January, February in our business, health and wellness, weight loss, we explode. I mean, everybody explodes in January and February because that's what people want to do, right? Everybody joins the gym. Everybody starts a diet. We want to be the ones that they think of when they're ready to make those changes. After they've gained the 10 pounds over the holidays, um, even though, you know, we tell weight, we don't necessarily want to always make it about weight loss at this time of year. That's what people start really thinking about. They think, start thinking about self-image. Um, so the calendar is going to be very full in November, December, and I want you guys to really wrap your minds around what you're doing now is going to show up and pay off when we hit the first of the year. So let's see next week's team call next Tuesday. I'm going to do a new ambassador training. Okay. So that's what we're going to do next week. You want to make sure, and I'll post, I'll do a graphic and that way you can post it. I'll go ahead and do the link early and that way you can send it to all of your new ambassadors. On the, the following Tuesday, I want you guys to go ahead and have this written down. Jill Werness, who is an Emerald Ambassador, she is a um, naturopath. She has incredible product knowledge. She's going to be on our call on November the 15th. And then on November the 22nd, we're going to have Emily Roberts. She's a Diamond Ambassador as our guest speaker. She's a military wife, young mom, and also she... Um, when she ranked to Diamond, had one of the most explosive teams in the company as well. So be looking forward to those really incredible um, calls that are coming up. I'm, we're going to do um, some online opportunity meetings. All right, we're going to we're going to pack the calendar with them. So I'm gonna, we're going to do one on November the 9th at 11 o'clock in the morning for all of the stay-at-home moms and stay-at-home people that can get on. So November 9th at 11 a.m. and then the next day, November 10th, we're going to do one at 9 p.m. So that's a Thursday night. All right, November the 13th which is coming up. I'm going to do a live training. Um, it's a Sunday afternoon from two to five here in Norfolk, Virginia. It's going to be at the Pasha Messe coffee house, write that down. And I will have a graphic and advertise. That's going to be a basic training. Um, we'll go, it'll be some, some basic stuff, but it'll be a good three hour training. So we'll be able to dig in and really get into some marketing and 
um, creative stuff. So it's really for everyone. We haven't done one in a while. I'm just doing it for our team. In the past, I've opened it up to other teams, and I just wanted to be really concentrated and intimate with our team. So that's going to be from 2 to 5, November 13th. On November the 17th, I'm looking to do a live opportunity event somewhere. Um, we might do it at Pasha Messe. They have a really nice um, coffee house or it's in Norfolk which is a central location so that location is to be determined uh, so that'll be something that you can invite your guests to so this is obviously for local people that are here with me um, all right November the 30th I'm gonna do an 11 o'clock a.m. opportunity meeting again on online this will be at like zoom format and then December the 1st at 9 o'clock an online opportunity meeting all right so my goal is to get graphics made for all of those and line up testimonies. I also worked really dil diligently today on a script for, op for online opportunity meetings. So instead of it just being kind of willy nilly with you know whatever I say or whatever you say, I actually have a script and I'm gonna put it in the file section and so I'm gonna challenge each of you guys to in addition to the ones that I'm doing, I want everybody to really be thinking. It's an awesome way to get people the information. So you'll have a script. Um, there was a leaders retreat, re, like sort of summary call that was done by a, someone on our team, a Destination Diamond Dream. We have a larger team. I'm going to post that. I really want you guys to all watch. Instead of us spending a lot of time on the leaders retreat recap, because I've just got so much I want to be doing, I want you guys to listen to that recap so you can kind of get an idea of what we learned and what's coming down the pike. Um, Plexus. Um, introduce the November incentive today which is really great it's an a custom plexus planner looks really awesome I know I've got a lot of planner enthusiasts I love getting a good planner too so it's really cool that plexus has put one together that's just designed for our business and it's not that hard to get it all you got to do is have three somethings for the month so that could be any combination of Customers or ambassadors, three, that could be like two ambassadors, one customer, three customers, three ambassadors, any combination, and you earn that planner. All right, so I expect tons and tons of people on our team to earn that. Um, also, in the back office, I want you guys to go check out, we have a new shareables, which are pretty cool. Our corporate has put together some really nice graphics and really great information about products. So you can go to the shareables on the menu and start using those because they're, they're always going to be compliant and they're really, really well done. Um, I haven't, I'm going to go check those out too. That's on my to-do list. Um, okay. And then I want to kind of close it out tonight with huge ah, recognitions. We had such a great month. I mean, Plexus just sweetened the pot so much by giving us the double ranking promotion incentives, but I want to recognize the people on our team that did promote in October. And we, I, I know out of the, the, I've been doing it for a couple of years going on. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's almost in three. That's crazy. But, um, it was definitely the most promotions we've ever had. So it's really, we're, we're, we've got momentum and we're in a good position. So I want to recognize our brand new gold ambassadors on our team, which are Dawn Regner, Michelle Hager Clark, and Anita Santiago, and I see Anita there. Anita waves. Everybody sees who you are. Yay! And I don't know if I have anybody else on here. Do I have Dawn or Michelle? If I do, wave you guys. I want you. I want everybody to see who you are. I'm looking. No, I don't know. But anyway, okay. But anyway, those are our new gold ambassadors. Getting from silver to gold can be the big, one of the big, one of the hardest challenges to kind of get from that just getting started place to having a nice team to lead. So that is really awesome. Congratulations, you guys. We had ten silver promotions on our team, which is great. It means these people hit the ground running. They got three ambassadors on their team, three active ambassadors. And I tried to list them all. If I butcher anybody's names, please, team leaders speak up and correct me. So I have my person, Tracy Jacobson. So congratulations, Tracy. And I think I just saw her on. Michelle Inman, Kim Ragazzi, Channing Rainier, Bobby Shea Murphy, which I saw her too. She's the one I wave you guys when I call your name out. Okay. Just kind of let everybody know that you're, so we can see you. Hey, Bobby. Good job. Uh, Becky Lynn, um, Gail and Anita. I don't know Gail. Tell me Gail's last name. Unmute yourself, Anita. So I know. What is it? Gail Evans. Evans. That's right. I didn't write that down. Gail Evans. We have uh, Christina Pollard. She's on your team too, right, Anita? Yes. Yes. Good. Yes. Um, 
Haley. Awesome. Haley, yes. So Gina Holloway, which is on Don Regner and Lisa Weinkoop's team, and then um, Michelle is also on your team, right, Anita? What is Michelle's last name? Michelle Hunter. Hunter, okay. I copied all the graphics, you guys, but a lot of them just had first names. So, I mean, I guess it's a good problem to have. Our team is so big. I'm like, I know, I got to know who these people are because these are our, the bright, our bright future. These are the people that are going to lead the way into the new year. So, awesome job. Um, let's see. I had a couple of senior gold re-ranks. So, congratulations to Joanna McGuire and Bethany Haywood for that. And Missy Sacken for a gold re-rank. And I hope I didn't miss anybody. I tried really hard not to miss anybody. But our team, I totaled it up, had a total of, oh, did I get Gina Holloway? Yeah, I said Gina. Um, our team total, just in bonuses, so these were just the October bonuses, had $4,850 in bonuses. So that's really great, you guys. Our team did, had a nice, nice, really nice month. Um, let me see what else I wanted to do here. We had... About 70 new team members joined in October, so that was very good. It's always hard to track it with upgrades, so that's why I say about 70, because sometimes the up when people go from preferred customer to um, ambassador, it's kind of hard to see. But about 70, so we've got 70 brand new people on our team that we really want to help them get hit the ground running. And so, you guys, what, what Emily just shared, that's what we need to be doing. That's what we need to be doing. That's what we need to be doing. Get these people rolling. Um, and I want to recognize my top five personal volumes on the team for October. We had number one, which personal volume, if you're new, means sales, basically what in customers, retail and preferred customers. Lisa Wan Cope had, I think, the best month ever. Was it your best month ever, Lisa? She had over $3,500 in PV. You can unmute and tell me. Um, I had one month that was $37. So. Oh, okay. So close. So $3,500, you guys. That's incredible. Really, really awesome. Number two was Rachel Glenn, and I know I see Rachel on there, so Rachel, wave at everybody so we know who you are. There's Rachel. Hey, Rachel. Um, congratulations to Beth Landfair, number three, and I know I saw Beth also. So there she is, waving. Hey, Michelle Anderson, who is not on the call because she texted me and said she couldn't be on the call. And number five, top five, is Sherry Sprouse. Is Sherry on the call? Let's see if Sherry's here. I don't see her. No, okay, but they'll probably watch the recording. So congratulations to all my top, my top people. So you guys had a, we had a great month. I I posted the top twenty on the page, so make sure you go look at that. Team leaders. Oh, Michelle is there. Michelle Haker Clark. Yeah, you are here. That's awesome. And Michelle was a goal. She posted here. What is the training date? The live training date is November the thirteenth. Um, and I'm going to do that at the Pasha Messe in, Norf in Norfolk. I discovered that place. It's awesome. It's got like a, a separate building that you can reserve. So we have our own space and it's centrally located in Norfolk because we have people from the peninsula, Virginia Beach. Um, and so on a Sunday afternoon, I don't think the traffic should be too bad in the tunnel. Um, okay. So team leaders, if I missed any recognitions, tell me now. Okay. <laughs> Um, so I want to make sure I didn't miss anybody or miss, miss do anything wrong there. Um, okay, very good. I'm not hearing from anybody, so I'll just assume that I did a good job remembering everybody and getting everybody straight. Um, okay, and so I like to, it's 10 o'clock. I know it's late, but I do, I, I actually just got a, um, a message, unfortunately, right before we started from Michelle Anderson that there was some things going on with some people on her team. So we're... I'm going to pray, just kind of close it out in prayer, that there was a couple people that are, let's see, just read on Facebook, a person that she met with about Plexus, about Plexus died, and then someone on Dodie's team is in the hospital. So I'm just going to kind of close it out with that and also just praying for a month ahead. So dear God, thank you for this time. Thank you for Emily spending time with us. Thank you for the blessing of learning from other teams and having sidelines who are willing to come and teach. So thank you for that. We pray. I pray so many blessings on every single team member, every single person that showed up here tonight that wants this business and wants to learn and grow. I just pray for wonderful blessings um, that they would really dig deep and find out why that makes them cry, Lord, and that you would bless their efforts and 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 just and create abundance. So we thank you for this opportunity. We thank you for this community. I thank you so much for this fabulous team. 
um, we know that this is a team sport. So it's really about the people that you surround yourself with. And that's what, that's what makes it so super fun. So we pray for the people that, um, Mich on, our, on Michelle's team and Dodie's team and that are on their heart. Sort of, we're not sure about the details, but we will just, um, pray that you would work out the details, Lord, and that you would give some peace and healing there. We ask all these things in your name. Amen. All right. 1003. We had a good solid hour call tonight, guys. Um, so I'm like really crazy excited. So watch out, you guys. <laughs> There's some, <laughs> I'm just going to be, I don't know, all over the place, flooding, flooding the team page with all kinds of announcements. So hold on tight, you guys, because this train's moving fast. All right. All right, guys. I'm going to end the meeting. Bye, guys. <laughs>